Hey, what's up, WWE fans? This is THQ Tank, your official WWE Games Community Manager, and I'm, uh, wow, all right. Back again with the uh, the trilogy, the three P, with my main man Seamus. How you doing, buddy? Fella, Excuse I'm your me. main man. I'm like, I'm his main man. You, you are the main man. You are. I'm his main man. Look at that. I've been How many people? times have we been down this road before? Two, three times. Three times. It's our third time. Uh, three. Third, count them three. Third times a charm, fella. Third times a charm. So what what is it about FCW? What what kind of traits do they teach you here that help you become a WWE superstar? Because again, WWE 12, when you create your superstar, it's all about making who you want to be. But what does it really take to be a WWE superstar? When I, when I, I, before I came here, I was on the independent scene, um, and uh, you know, you don't ever get feedback, or you know, especially in England, in Ireland, there's not really people to help you, guide you uh, to where you want to be. And coming here to this facility and with the trainers that we had, top world class trainers, Dr. Tom Bridge, Steve Karen, Steve Rhodes, Norm Smiley, and Billy Kidman was here too. Uh, it just what it does is they, they give you direction of where you need to go. It's a WB style. They help you tell stories. And, um, they help you teach, you know, they teach you how to tell those stories. And another thing about it is respect. You know, it's like they teach you respect for, the, for what we do, for the business. You know, they they'll help. When you get, you know, when you come here, you're not a, you're not a lucrative contract or anything. You're on a basic a basic salary just to get you through the day. And it's your passion that brings you through. And I was here a year and a half. There's people have been here longer than that, but. Set, you know, kind of weed, to help weed out people who you know don't belong here or, or don't have the passion. To do. But they, they they mold you into they mold you. They they, they give you direction where you want to be. They teach you respect uh, for the business, and then they give you the direction you need to go. You, the, the story in Road to WrestleMania, you're a third of that story. You are a major component of that story. Um, tell the fans how you feel. I, I think you, uh, you're... I feel great, right. fella! <laughs> I'm a career storyline, I'm a core part of this video game, the villain Seamus. It doesn't matter if you love me or hate me, all that matters is I'm a core part of this video game. It's WWE 12, it's the Celtic Choir, and fella, I have all the goals. Yeah! <laughs> Thanks, man. Thank you. Oh, it's great, you love it. Thank you. Next time I promise, I'll, I'll, I'll spike the hair for you. He wants me right. to spike the hair, I'll spike the hair up. Take care, spike your hair. He said something about wearing a clown cake or something. I don't know, wearing a clown costume, I don't know what that is, but next time well, I promise. Saying, always, I promise next time I'll spike the hair, right? I spike my hair, I, I come here to interview, I, you know, I expect that you're gonna have, we're gonna have this like spiky hair show off. You know, the spiky hair stare down, whatever you want to call it. No, you make me you feel know. bad, I feel good about myself. You should myself feel bad. Game, Zack Ryder's walking titles. around with spiky hair, you know, you're your spike hair is obviously way better than his. You gotta show it off. My hair was spiked long before Zack Ryder. I know it was. That's what stole, I'm saying. Stole my image. That's what I'm saying. Stole my image. Woo, woo, woo. I'm not trying to do that. Please, don't mention the name of my friends. Don't mention it. Well, we know you, you developed it. Theory is over. Don't mention the name of my friends. Theory is over. <laughs> <laughs>